APA Citation 7th Edition Formatting Your In-Text Citations with APA 7 Proper citation is extremely important. Citations attribute ideas to their creators, help to avoid plagiarism and academic dishonesty, and it allows others to access the sources you have used. Every idea or piece of information you receive from another source must be cited whether it is a direct quote or a paraphrase of something you have read. In-text citations are the clues that lead your reader to the full citations on your reference list. The full citations on your reference list allow your reader to locate the information you quoted in your paper. There are two different types of in-text citations, a direct quote and a paraphrase. A direct quote is the use of a word or word phrase or several phrases from another author in your paper. A paraphrase is an expression of an idea that someone else said in your own words. Each appear in your paper in a different way. A direct quote would have quotation marks around it, while a paraphrase would not. There are two ways you can use in-text citations by either weaving the information into the text or placing it at the end. Two pieces of information are always included, the author's last name and the date. Here are some examples of the same piece of information being quoted in three different ways. In the first example, all the information needed is inserted directly into the text. In number two, the author's name is woven directly into the text. In this instance, APA allows the date to be inserted in parentheses directly behind the author's name. You could also insert the date at the end if you choose. The third example does not state any source in the text. Instead, it is inserted directly behind the text. To cite a specific part of a source, include information about the specific part, like a page number. Individual page quotations should begin with a P period, while multiple page numbers should begin with a PP period. A comma and a space should separate the publication date and page number. If a quotation contains 40 words or more, treat it as a block quotation. Start a block quotation on a new line and indent the whole block one half inch from the left margin. Double space the entire block quotation. Do not add extra space before or after it. Either cite the source in parentheses after the quotation's final punctuation, or cite the author and year in the narrative before the quotation, and place only the page number in parentheses after the quotation's final punctuation. Do not add a period after the closing parentheses in either case. For a work with one or two authors, include the author names in every citation. For a work with three or more authors, include the name of only the first author plus et al. in every citation. Use an ampersand when citing in parentheses and the word and when within the text. Here are some examples. To avoid ambiguity when the in-text citations of multiple works with three or more authors shorten to the same form, Write out as many names as needed to distinguish the references and abbreviate the rest of the names to et al. in every citation. Et al. is plural, meaning and others. If the first authors of multiple references share the same surname but have different initials, include the first author's initials in all in-text citations, even if the year of publication differs. Initials help avoid confusion within the text and help readers locate the correct entry in the reference list. For works with an unknown author, include the title and year of publication in the in-text citation. Note that the title moves to the author position in the reference list entry as well. If the title of the work is italicized in the reference list entry, also italicize the title in the in-text citation. If the title of the work is not italicized in the reference list entry, use double quotation marks around the title in the in-text citation. Capitalize these titles in the text using title case. If the title is long, shorten it for the in-text citation. 
For more citation help, see the publication manual of the American Psychological Association 7th edition at any library reference desk or on reserve at your campus library. Also check out our citation research guide. San Jacinto College librarians are always willing to help. Just ask a librarian.